Let's look at some stuff going on first. Uh, let's get right into it. Mr. Kid Rock fires back at critics of his new single, Quit Being So Damn Offended. Toughen up and enjoy life. Which is ironic, right? It's ironic that Kid Rock is saying, quit being so damn offended. Dude, you made a fucking song about being offended, basically. You you made a song about, like, what's going on and, like, you you... you you were the most offended because you made a whole song about it. I don't know what to say. You know what I noticed, though? The Kid Rock single, Kid Rock is like um, Franz from Attila. They have that same energy. Now, I'm I actually like, um, I don't hate Franz. I don't, I don't, I don't necessarily like it. that kind of music. It's not, not up my alley, right? And that's kind of like... You need to, like, understand these things. And, like, just because it's not up my alley doesn't mean I don't hate it. It's just not my thing, right? Like, I'm the fucking guy noodling around with, like, jazz chords. like Right? I'm doing that kind of stuff. Franz is singing about, like, fucking bitches and fucking, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what else he's, you know, he has uh, talk shit, eat pussy, that kind of thing. Right? That's, I'm not into it, but, like. This video Kid Rock did for his like single, it's ridiculous. It's just like ridiculous. It's like it's like Tim and Eric and Attila work together and try to make like a butt rock song. It's it's absolutely ridiculous. I you know, obviously that was the point to make it like super, super controversial, ridiculous, all that stuff. Not really like, you know, like I watched it, I was like, oh okay, this is whatever. It's, you know, it is what it is. If you're into that stuff, then cool. But, like, I also, like, wasn't... A lot of the stuff he, he talks about, I'm obviously, like, the other way on, you know? But, like, I don't really, like... Okay, whatever. Uh, let me read some of these lyrics, because I don't even know where I start. 20 years later, bitch, I still fucking mean it. Bucka, bucka, you ain't never met a motherfucker like this. Kiss my ass. Then you suck a dick sideways. <laughs> Yeah, dude, like, sure, this is art. <laughs> this is cool. Years ago, we all thought it was a joke. See, that ever kid got a motherfucking trophy. But yo, homie, here's the situation. Nation of pussies is our next generation. Another funny thing about this. I love the way, like, these the older, the boomers talk about, oh, this generation is a bunch of pussies. These generations... They don't have work ethic. Oh, this generation, they don't, you know, they're they're too soft. We're giving them trophies for everything. Motherfucker, you brought this generation. Do you understand? Like, what, you are the, the boomer generation. They're the, the, the parents of this generation, okay? Like, hey, does, like, does that not click to your fucking brain? Like, you're the one who, these people are the ones who raised this generation. What the fuck are you trying to say? This generation is a bunch of pussies. Cool, you made us pussies. If you want to, if you agree to that. I don't understand, like, your kids, if they, I'm sure, like, if, if Kid Rock has kids, and he, they probably have kids that uh, follow under this script that he is talking about, like, dude, they were raised by your generation, and your generation was raised by your parents. You understand how that works? Yeah. Some shit's wild, I guess. You're being a fucking boomer about it. You're being an idiot. But it's also like, dude, take responsibility. You guys raised these kids. Okay? Like, that's that. It's not like these kids were just born and then set free at, at birth. And then you're just kind of like, all right, hopefully they, they work out. Hopefully uh, that's our next generation right there. Just let's see. No, dude, you were supposed to teach them shit. That's how it works. You teach them. You raise them. A piece of you goes into them, right? Like when a kid is born, like they're pretty neutral. I mean, there's going to be little dynamics here and there, but it's like, dude, they they don't know anything. They're learning from their parents. Whatever their parents teach them. They they're gonna that's gonna reflect on their personality and what kind of person they become. If they live in a shit home, there you know there's gonna be trauma. There's gonna be things they have to deal with. If they live in a good home, they're gonna be a good person. If they live in a shitty home where where the parents are racist and there's all this stupid sh ignorant shit happening. That kid is probably gonna be like that too. That's how it goes. 
And if these kids eventually they'll learn about morals and things like that. But it's the parents responsibility to make sure that these kids understand right from wrong, how the world works for them. Um, and, you know, this is it's not as universal because you got to kind of take it culture by culture. Because like more more morality in the other side of the world is going to be different than what it is here, the way people show respect here is different. You know, like but that all comes down to like what the parents teach the children, and the children will understand work ethic, and they'll understand like how to live their life based on what their parents teach them, or the teachers who are also the fucking boomers. How does that not go through your head? Like, hey, be be a better parent. If you're going to complain about this generation being whatever the fuck, like, you fucked up as a parent. <laughs> Kid Rock did. I, I'm talking about Kid Rock. Like, his kid's set. If he, I think he has kids. I don't know. I have no fucking clue. I don't know anything about Kid Rock. But, yeah. A nation of pussies is our next generation. Yeah, dude, you fucking, your generation made that quote-unquote nation of pussies. That's fucking your fault. You snowflakes, here's a news flash. Ain't nobody going to tell me how to live. Dude, it's your responsibility to teach your kid how to live. Years ago, all thought it was a joke. See, but that, okay, that but, but yo, homie, here's the situation. A nation puts it next generation. Okay, yeah. And these mini, okay, yeah. Right. It's ridiculous. It's dumb. Like, <laughs> fucking what a guy. Whatever.